Back on December 16th, the 1-0 Hopkinton Hillers varsity hockey team played their second game of the season against Dover Sherborne, and things went rather well. Well for the Hillers, Zach Morgan, and there's a goal. The Hillers score, it went deflected in. J.H. Vokey started things off with a goal for the Hillers. He avoids a check, and now he's going to get out of the zone. He throws it up the side to, to Coveney. Coveney takes a wide slap shot. Oh, it hits on the mask of the goaltender, Colangelo. After the J.H. Vokey goal, both goaltenders exchanged great saves. Breaking in is Condon. Condon shot and a save by O'Leary. Backhanded shot is another save by O'Leary, and he covers it. But then the Hillers scoring started. Can lay some place to Vokey. Shot and a goal! J.H. Vokey picks up the second goal for Hopkinton on a nice pass by Finlayson. And the Hillers take a 2 to nothing lead. Yes, throws it back to the point, and it's intercepted. Here's Finlayson with speed. He's by himself. He makes a move, and it's a shot, and it's a save. I think Colangelo got a piece of that. It's loose in front. Here's Finlayson, and a shot, and a goal. Finlayson passed it in front to Abbott, it was a nice, soft pass, and Abbott tucked it home for the goal. It's 3-1, Hillers. And now the break, and here's Bokey. He's got a goal already tonight. T passes to himself, there's another shot, and a goal! Bokey has another! But not out. Here's Linkers, oh, nice pass, and a backhand goal! By Owen Delaney! From Eric Linquist. The Hillers grab the 5-2 win as J.H. Vokey nets two goals. Matt Lindquist, Will Abbott, and Owen Delaney had a goal apiece. After a tough loss to Medfield on the road December 19th, the Hillers took their frustrations out on Norton back on December 23rd. That goes wide now. It's a wide open net, and it is in. Finlayson. Cam Finlayson takes a puck that was hard off the backboard and jams at home and the Hillers take a 1-0 lead. To the center ice it goes, Simos across ice. Here comes Abbott, Abbott tries to avoid his man, he does. He throws in front, dip and try, and it's a goal! Now Kobe squares up shot and it's blocked in front. There's another shot and it's in. From the circle it's Billy oh, yeah. Allen and the Hillers take a 3-0 lead. It's McCluskey, Temple. Back to the point, slap shot, it's blocked in front by, and there's a shot and a goal, a roof shot backhander by Nick Temple, and the Hillers take a 4-0 lead. Simos takes a shot, and it goes in! He roofs it over the goaltender, and it goes off the post and in. Chipping it. He has it, Linquist, nice pass. Oh, he has a man, a shot and a goal. Owen, Dola Owen Delaney with a goal. The Hillers knock off Norton 6 to nothing as sophomore goaltender Dylan O'Leary pitches his first shutout. Cam Finlayson contributed with a pair of goals as the Hillers improved to 3-1 on the season. The Hillers got wins in their next three games, taking down Lunenburg, Fitchburg, and Holliston. They stood at 6-1 entering this week. On December 18th, the 0-1 Hillers boys basketball team took on Millis. Zach Sasitsky hits this three to put the Hillers up by seven in the second quarter. Hillers went into the halftime locker room up 31-24. Start of the third quarter, Jack Vacari finds Austin Odell, goes off the glass and in. The Hillers went on a 10-0 run to start the third, and they never looked back, getting a 64-52 victory over Millis. The 1-1 one one Hillers boys then took on Medway December 21st. Second quarter, some sweet passing. Finds Nick Canal at the low block and he goes in for the deuce. The Hillers went into the halftime locker room up 36-29. Third quarter, Zach Sasitsky feeling it from three-point land. The Hillers maintained control and took the game 65-55. Nick Canal came up huge with 29 points in the victory. The Hillers boys dropped a pair during the holiday break and stood at 2-3 and three overall coming into this week. The girls team played Medway prior to the boys, 35-35 in the third, and Sarah DePillo changes that with this three. DePillo tallied 27 points for the Mustangs as Medway handed Hopkinton 
their first loss of the season, 60-53. The Hillers girls stood at 3-1 after the loss.